property 3 of determinant. If two rows or column of a determinant are identical, that is, all the corresponding elements are same, the value of the determinant is 0. Let's see. Let's say A is equal to 4, 6, 7, 4, 6, 7, 3, 2, 1. And let's say B is equal to 4, 6, 7, 4, 6, 7, 3, 2, 1. Right? Now what does this law say? If two rows or two columns two rows or columns. What I mean here is two columns of a determinant are identical. That is, all the corresponding elements are same. If you refer to O, you have column 1 and you have column 2. So if you see, amongst these two columns, the value of the corresponding items are same. 4, 4, 6, 6, 7, 7. Right? According to the law of matrix, according to the property of matrix, if two columns have identical value, that is all the corresponding elements are same, then det A or delta is equal to 0. Right? Similarly, if two rows of a matrix or a determinant are same, then again, the same thing. The value has to be 0. Right? So, debt B is also going to be 0 over here. Why? Because R1 and R2 are same. So, let us say whether we can see if this is true. So let's calculate delta over here using the first row. So 4, you get 6, 7, 2, 1. Minus 4, which is the second element, you get 6, 7, 2, 1 over here again. Plus 3, 3 is this, so you get 6, 7, 6, 7 over here. Or 4 into 6 into 1 gives you 6 minus 7 into 2 gives you 14 minus 4 6 into 1 gives you 6 7 into 2 gives you 14 plus 3 6 into 7 gives you 42 minus 6 into 7 gives you 42 so 6 minus 14 is minus 8 okay minus 8 into 4 is minus 32 minus 6 minus 14 is what? Minus 8 again. Minus 8 into minus 4 is plus 32. Plus 42 minus 42 is 0. 0 into 3 is 0. And 32 minus 32 again is 0. Hence, the property that if any two columns of a determinant are same, then the value of the determinant is equal to 0. Let's similarly verify it for the rows as well. So let again expand using row 1. So we have 4, we have 6 and we have 7. Okay. This is plus, this is minus, this is plus. 4, 6 into 1 gives you 6 minus 7 into 2 gives you 14. Minus 6, which is this one. So you ignore this row and this column. So 4, 3, 7, 1. Right? And you, when you use 7, you can use 4, 3, 6, 2. So this will give you 6 minus 4 minus 8 into plus 4 is going to give you minus 32. Minus 6 into 4 into 1, 4 minus 7 into 3, 21 plus 7. 4 into 2 is 8 minus 6 into 3 is 18. Right? So you get minus 32 
4 minus 21 minus 17 minus 17 into minus 6 is plus 102. Right? 8 minus 18 is minus 10. Minus 10 into 7 is minus 70. Again, if you add up the three number, what do you get? You get 0. Hence the property that if two rows are same, row 1 is equal to row 2 in a sense, then the value of the determinant is 0.